fucker is gone, guys. So you... Here, I'm just gonna get the fucking started this video. So, you know... Yeah, I got them wheel spaces on, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh my god, I wish I did. No. No, no, no. Here, here, here. I want to show you guys how to take off the towel. And... I want to show you guys how to take off a towel and hub. In one step. So, what you want to do... Is you get your hand. Put on the towel. And just pull. There you go. Uh... Yeah, that doesn't look good. It's not good. I got to buy a new hub, which is 70, probably about 100 bucks, I'll say. Um, I might just get two, and you know, have rebuild my whole front end. That's how I rebuilt this side wasn't. That's what I'm saying. If you only build one side, we build the other. Because eventually, the one side you didn't rebuild is going to be fucked up. But anyways, so yeah, I went downtown, and I, you know, I was helping out homie. He was like, yo, I need a ride, you know. He, you know, he has a bike, and he lives by my house. And he was down in downtown only doing the shit he does, you know, hustling. Um, so I was like, yeah, you know, I got you. So, uh, anyways, um, so I went down there, and I, um, like, his phone died. So I was driving around, and boom, I seen him. And I was like, yo, what's up, man? You know, I'm here. You know, and then he hopped in and threw his bike in the back. Then we were driving down 4th Avenue. I mean, like, not a second after he got in, or like, it was about two minutes after he got in the vehicle. And, um, you know, I, I went down 4th Avenue. And, uh, uh, I was sitting gone, and I was like, dude, and he was like, dude, that's not good. And I was like, yeah, don't worry about it. You know, I already know what it is. It, you know, I didn't think it was this. So, um, yeah, just, you know, after I picked him up, and he's honestly don't worry about the fucking grind, and, um, uh, we was going on 4th Avenue, my and my brake pad fell off, and I lost all my brakes. And I was like, um, that's not good. Like, why did I just lose all my brakes? Well, I knew why my brake pad fell off. Out, but I was like, how the fuck does a brake pad fall out? Like, there's no room for it to go anywhere. But anyways, um... So, uh... I mean, I pulled into the whale. Um... Actually, let me get, some, let me get a jack stand so I have the support on that. But yeah, I went to the whale and all that. And I, he went over got my brake pad. Of course, my stupid ass... Didn't have my jack in here. I had all the other toys take it out, take the stuff off and everything, but I didn't have any other jack, right? Um, I didn't have this one. I had a call rack, like a regular old, like for my mom's Toyota. I had that one, and uh. I can't have anything right now. But, um, anyways, so, uh, yeah, like, I was not gonna try to jack this big ass vehicle up with that, you know? So, uh, anyways, uh, it's good enough. So, uh, sorry, guys. I keep forgetting what I have to say. But, uh, yeah, he went down, guys. I got, I had a call friend get me a, my jack. I'm actually, I'm gonna leave it like that. So, if this does go down, it's just on this. But, uh, so, my friend came down, and he was like, you know, I jacked her up and everything, right? So, uh, I was like, and then, you know, my friend got snatched, and he was like, come out here, let's get in Tyler. His brake pad just fucking fell out. So, uh, yeah, I, uh, I got jacked up, and I was about, I was, I was taking off the towel, and I felt, it, like, moving like this, it moved like this, and I was like, um, that's not supposed to happen. So, anyways, um, so, then I found out that my hub exploded, like, those metal shavings everywhere, like, it's done, 
you know, I'm hoping, hoping my axle level isn't done, but it might be. It just might be. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was, that's what was scraping, guys. I think. But anyways, um, also, the fucking thing with the hubs and shit was scraping. But also, um, so, uh, wait, well, I can't fucking remember where I was at. So anyways, you know, I found out that was supposed to be there. So I was like, fuck, dude. Like, so I was asking about like, that was around, because, you know, there's a bunch of people there. There was a, a guy that has on tow comp his tow company and all that. And, you know, and I was like, uh, I was like, dude, is there any way I could put my hu hub back together and drive it home tonight? And he said, no, you have two options. Well, you don't have to get towed anyways, but you can sleep in here at night and wait till tomorrow and... Call your parents to get towed, or you know, or anything like that. So, uh, anyways, um, I was like, "Fuck, dude." So I called my dad up, and he was like, "Really? Like, this had to happen tonight?" Well, like, I guess so. You know, like, I'm kind of happy it happened because you know, now I get new parts of my truck. But now I'm hoping I can, uh, that I can, uh, actually, uh, fix this tomorrow. I gotta go to work and stuff. But anyways, so yeah, I called my dad up and he was, like, pretty mad at me. Which, I mean, I can't, I can't do nothing about it, you know. <coughs> I take blame because I should have checked and... I should have inspected my truck a little more. But, you know, I didn't mess with my tires. I didn't mess with any of that. I fucking removed the transmission and pulled, pulled back in, you know? So, uh... Anyways, uh, so, yeah, he was like, yeah, just call a fucking tow truck, tow truck company and get towed back. So I called him. Oh, my God, the guy's reaction... When he came, he has never dealt with anything like this. He didn't know too much about vehicles because, you know, he doesn't do anything like repairing vehicles or anything. Um, so he, he just laughed at me. He was like, of course, this had to happen. Fuck, I don't like how shit that that is. So I, someone... I'm going to uh, relief, relief, trust in that, there we go, alright, so yeah, he was like, dude, how you, how you want to do this, like, um, he was like, one thing to do, if you care about, this, if you don't care about your tires, which I love these tires, these tires are so nice, <laughs> and he was like, if you don't care about the tires, you know, we will jack it up, and lay it on the tire, and then, drag up on the flatbed, and I was like, Nah, dude, you know, I can't, I can't do that. You know, these tiles are too expensive, you know? So, um, I mean, like, fuck. It's about 70 bucks each for, oh, about 100 bucks each for a regular tile. Mine, all about 300 bucks each around there. So, uh, I was like, I can't do that. I just, you know, fuck that. So I was like, you know, I got a good idea. I'm going to put the tile back on. I'm going to put everything back together. And I'm, we're going to try to just roll it. And we almost had it on a flatbed. And my tile was like this. And I was like, okay, uh, we can't go no more. It's going to fuck up more shit. We're going to have more issues. I'm going to have to pay and buy a new pulse and everything. So let's just stop here. Let's just give me a second. Let me think what I'm going to do. So I was like, you got any ratchet straps? He was like, yeah, I got ratchet straps. I was like, all right. So I'm going to jack up the vehicle. I'm going to put the tile back on. And I'm going to ratchet trap the tile to... I'm going to ratchet trap it back on pretty much. And then I'm going to put the skid block, which is a block meant for dragging. 
um, I'm gonna put that under the tile, and you know we're gonna try that. So yeah, I got um ours. We got that, and um, this other guy came up and he was like, um, another tow truck came to help out because the guy that was towing my truck didn't really know what to do. And I was like, yeah, we've been this guy, and he was like, uh, right, hold on. Hey, here's my crush. This guy doesn't care about this shit. Like, look at my skin. That skin was so fucking ugly. He took this off. Like, he, he just took this off. He was like, fuck it. He didn't ask if he could get my truck or anything. Um, he was a joke, too. Which, you know, I don't fucking, like, what, what does that to do, you know? I just my bug pad. This video has been so long, guys. I'm sorry. But anyways, um, yeah. So, we put this loader on the truck. You know. On the way, um, there are the towers. Like that. And I was like, you know, just fucking keep driving, dude. We have it on the truck. I don't want to waste your time. Or anything like that. So, the bill, though, was $158. Wasn't bad. It's $3.50 a mile. Um, but it's $85 charge, like, all around. Like, for them to come out and stuff, that's $85 charge. So, uh... Yeah, fuck that door. So, yeah, you know, I got here. His story is just fucking amazing. Like, he has those some crazy-ass shit. I'll tell you guys that in their story. But anyways, guys, yeah. If you hear gunning, I got one tip for you. If you hear gunning in your vehicle, stop, go home, inspect it and shit, because... This is, you're going to fuck up your vehicle if you just keep driving. I was so excited to have my truck on. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry for the long ass video. You know, it could have been a 30 minute story, but it, it isn't. But anyways guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe for more. And shout out to Bonkers. I fucking love them. It's a weirdo. If you guys want off of the videos, let me know. Because those are coming soon. This summer. They are coming. After I get this fucker on, after I get enough money, I fill my tank up and put more toys in here. And I think I'm getting off of vehicles for, I mean, I'm getting off of videos for you guys. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Please like and subscribe for more. Thank you.